This magnificent lad is a mantis shrimp. In specific, this one is the peacock mantis shrimp. Now, there are many species of mantis shrimp that are found quite widely distributed through tropical and subtropical ocean waters pretty much all around the world. Despite the name, they're not actual shrimp, they're kind of their own thing within the larger group of crustaceans and also arthropods. They are all incredibly efficient and aggressive predatory hunters, and they're also one of the most overpowered animals ever in the entire animal kingdom. They have these ridiculously powerful front claws that kind of come in two main morphologies, either the smashers or the spearers. And those do pretty much what you would expect based on the name. The smashers smash via blunt force and the spears kind of stab and spear their prey. And these front claws, either the smasher or the spear, they're incredibly hard and strong calcified claws that extend at a ridiculously fast and powerful pace. The extension of these raptorial front claws have an impact about equivalent to an actual bullet. And so, if they're just a little fish or clam or something minding its own business, they will get absolutely obliterated by these claws. The claws themselves can either punch or spear through pretty much any thing that they want to, including clam shells, oyster shells, crab shells, all of which are pretty hard materials. And in addition to just being incredibly powerful themselves, the extension of these claws cause what are called caviation bubbles, and these bubbles, when they collapse and pop, produce this incredibly strong and powerful shock wave that kind of goes through the water in the direction of the strike by the claw. And so, that prey item actually ends up getting hit by two separate forces, the initial claw first and then after this very strong shock wave that is so powerful that even if the initial strike by the claw misses, they will still probably be stunned by the second shock wave, and then the mantis shrimp will still be able to eat. In addition to just having ridiculously overpowered claws, they also have incredibly good and unique eyesight, having some of the most complex eyes out of any animal that we've discovered thus far. The two eyes can move independently in three dimensions on each stalk, and they also have a ridiculously high number of photoreceptors or light-sensing cells. Humans have three or even two sometimes different types of photoreceptors, whereas the mantis shrimp has between 12 and 16 depending on the species. This means they can see way, way more different wavelengths than humans can, and they can also see polarized light, which is incredibly rare in the animal kingdom, and they see it in a way that thus far no other animal can that we've discovered. However, this eyesight isn't perfect. They do reportedly have some trouble distinguishing between small individual wavelengths and have a bit of a delay in their vision. However, evidently that does not matter so much since they are one of the most effective predators. They're also incredibly territorial and aggressive to both members of their own species and just other organisms in general and apparently they growl too. Some people do keep these as pets in aquariums, however, they're incredibly difficult to keep because they're so aggressive, and you may have to keep replacing your aquarium glass because they can and will punch through it. <laughs> 